guys welcome back to another android studio tutorial and this time i'm going to show you how to create the card view in the android studio without any programming so this is something different from what you have seen from many other videos and other tutorials on the websites so let's go to the design and as you can see i have a symbol layout here what i'm going to do actually is sim removing the hello world now i have an empty activity now let's go and change the relative layout into scroll view so now inside that we have to set a linear layout to add the curve view so for that i'm just searching for linear layout and we have to select the vertical version let's add it here after that what we have to do is that inside the linear layout we have to add our card view so for that what well, the first thing is to go to the cradle then go to the second one the build.gradle module app and here you have to add a dependency and that is okay after that you have to click on the sync now and once the sync complete just close that tab and go to the activity main now add the card view so android you can easily add it using the widget uh, card view match parent match parent and uh, another thing is to xml and s so next add a relative layout here i'm adding a relative layout with match parent then match parent now let's add something the text view in it so text view match parent web content and the text goes here text now let's go to the design and check it out so right now here is a card view as you can see i'm just increasing the size into 30 and as you can see here is a card view you can also add image view into the card view so guys now as you can see here is in a something text with the image view and totally it is in a card view let's add something i will say more than one card view just copy all the things paste next then next again and all this time we have to change the IDs for each of the widgets. Okay. So now as you can see guys, here is a three card of views. So okay, so what the next thing the next step is to add one click listener for all these card of views. So when the user press this, we have to add the ID to respond to the click. So for that, I'm selecting the first card of view, and here it is just add an id for the card view so simply id equal to cd1 so i have added the id for the three card views now let's go to the active main activity simply show the card view here so card view cd1 cd2 cd3 okay so now let's show the cd1 first cd1 door oh so right now i have the three card views here i'm simply adding the listener for the card view so cd1 door set one click listener then new one click listener i'm simply adding a toast to make the result okay guys so i have added the id for the three and uh, the three card views and i have added the said one click listener for all the three card views now let's go and check it in your live device case so guys thanks for watching this video i hope you have got the idea if so subscribe to my channel for later updates peace out